Hey, what's going on everyone? JC here from Lawn Squad Mowing. In this video, I wanna talk a little about winter ice melts to help you decide which is best for you. Now, there are many options available in the market, including blends and such, but I wanna narrow it down to some of the most commonly used ones. Many people ask which ice melts are safe for concrete and asphalt. And the answer to that is many of them aren't. What causes damage to concrete and asphalt is the constant thaw and freeze process. Concrete is porous and when water freezes in the cracks, ice will expand it, weakening the concrete over time. But by choosing the right product along with proper preparation and the correct application, you can help in preserving the integrity of your surface. One of the most popular choices is rock salt, otherwise known as sodium chloride. It's cheap and typically easily available. The cons are that it, it's only effective down to 20 degrees, which promotes the thaw and freeze process, accelerating deterioration. Rock salt is a little less damaging to asphalt, but could be detrimental if the asphalt is already damaged. Next, let's talk about urea, typically marketed as pet safe and environmentally friendly. The pros are that it's not too damaging to concrete and asphalt, probably the least damaging out there, but far less effective as an ice melt since it only works best at about 25 to 30 degrees. Most urea ice melts will claim to work down to 10 degrees, but still not very effective. Over application of urea or any ice melts for that matter can damage vegetation and lawns, some less than others, but again, proper application is key. Next, let's talk about magnesium chloride. My personal advice, stay away from it if you're applying to concrete. It's effective at melting ice, but magnesium leaches out calcium hydroxide to form calcium salt within the concrete, which further promotes deterioration over a longer amount of time. Lastly, calcium chloride, like what you see right here, is the least damaging to concrete and asphalt, with the exception of urea. When properly applied, calcium chloride is an effective ice melt in temperatures down to negative 25 degrees. And the good thing is, because of that, it minimizes the thaw and freeze process cycles. So with these options, my personal choice is calcium chloride in preventing damage. Remember to always read your labels and instructions and always use gloves as these products are chemicals and draw moisture, which could be harmful to your hands. I hope that this information was useful to you. And if you're looking for more helpful information, be sure to check out the many other posts on here at Echo Means Business. Simply create an account by downloading the Echo Means Business app or by visiting www.echomeansbusiness.com. You could follow me on Instagram at JC underscore the lawn care guy and on YouTube by searching JC the lawn care guy. Thanks for watching everyone and stay tuned for content from the Echo Means Business community. Take care.